Welcome back to Saw, the f blockbuster video game based on a blockbuster major motion picture franchise chain. Uh, everyone loves Jigsaw. Everyone loves the puppet. You know who people don't love? Detective Tap. They don't like him. Like, blaming him that for all everything that's been happening. Those are bombs. That door's closed. Doors. Each will test your faith. Will you continue blindly or will you face a greater challenge with your sight intact? Make your choice quickly. When the timer reaches zero, the bombs located all around you will detonate. Alright, I mean I like I like sight. I enjoy it. Uh-oh. Let's be careful here. <laughs> he leans so far. <laughs> Door sealed. I don't have the thing to unlock that. But I can squeeze through here. Uh, how did they even set this up? Come on, Jigsaw. Come on, I'm tr I'm in trouble believing this. I be I'm in trouble believing you set this up. I think you hired someone to do that. You hired a contractor. Wash your hands. Oh, coupler, there it was. One of these fun things. We love these puzzles. This door is... Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, we got a proper flashlight. That camera really wasn't doing a very good job. Take a look at that again. Let's see. Find a key to open the utility door. All right. So that's our our current goal. Stun trap schematics. Okay, let's see. If it wasn't bad enough that there's a killer out there mashing up taxpayers in the itty bits, now we have the cops to worry about, too. To his own admission, Detective David Tapp completely disregarded the process and went rogue, convincing his partner, Detective Stephen Singh, to join him in an, in an unwarranted entry to catch the Jigsaw Killer. Not only did they break into Jigsaw's secret hideout without a warrant, but they didn't wait for any backup either, probably hoping to get all the glory for themselves. Well, Jigsaw got the drop on them, slicing Tap's throat from ear to ear and nailing Singh in the top of the head with a double-barrel shotgun. All this was confirmed by witness Jeff Thomas, who was in one of Jigsaw's little traps. He claimed Singh saved his neck, but when Tap got sliced and Singh got blasted, good old Jeff was stuck in the trap until help arrived. Is this a real article? I mean, it doesn't, it's not, it doesn't seem like it's written like a real article, but according to this, we're uh, confirmed dead. 
I guess no one's gonna try come looking for old Detective Tap because everyone thinks Detective Tap is dead. If we can trust this newspaper article. The patients are beginning to m demand a religious area in the asylum where they can pray. Medication to keep them more agreeable is not working. If anything, they're getting worse. If we don't do anything about this soon, we could have a full-blown riot on our hands. If we can take the courtyard area and build up a small chapel there, I think they'll shut up about it. Nurse Cleaver. Well, what religion? What, uh, what do they want to pray to? Is, is there nowhere else to go from here? Because that's sealed. That is also sealed. Can't take more ammonia. We already have too much ammonia. I am full of ammonia. And uh, this is a bathroom, so no door leading out of this. Can we open that? Okay, we can't open that. Oh, it's one of these. Okay. F f I'm sorry. I never didn't even remember the syringe toilet. You think I would say, oh, of course, it's a bathroom. Of course, there is a syringe-filled toilet. What am I thinking? I'm being silly. It's snowing tonight. Snow's coming through the hole in the ceiling. All right, so this was our goal. Now, restore power to the security checkpoint gate. This is what happens to those who fail their tests or make the wrong choice. You cannot save this man, but you can save yourselves. Find the combination to open his cage and reroute the power back to the doors. But do so quickly. When he touches the water. Why is he talking like there's two of us here? So many numbers. Right, how do we... How do we line them up? Maybe like that. Uh, I mean, that three is like that, but it doesn't seem like anything else is coming up. No, I got it. I, I understand it's the perspective thing. Uh, I don't think that's one's too big, one's too small there. Can that line up? Yeah. Right, that seven is kind of lining up. Yep, seven. I see. Any, is there anything else that looks like it lines up from here? I got the four lines up, and if the the seven's not really lining up, not really. I get a better position for that four. Once again, nothing else has really come. Okay, well, no, four, three, five, maybe. Four, three, five, possibly. Okay, it was that. Alright, anything to look at in here? I mean, we, need, we need a coupler. I do not have one of those. Does he have? No, I, I, can't, I can't search him. Oh, 
There's a nail, but that's not what I need. Nail's not going to do the job. Still nothing. That door won't open. I didn't see anything else around. Well, we got the combination, but I did not find the coupler. Explore the world around you! Some enemies have traps of their own. I guess let's see if it's the same combination every time. Okay, there we go. We can just skip it like that. Is it four, three, five every time? It is. Okay. Alright, just to make sure. It's not in here, is it? Like, it probably wouldn't be. They probably would put it somewhere else. There it is. I didn't see that one. easily defeated by anyone who's paying attention. It's really barely an inconvenience, honestly. Someone would have to be really careless to actually die from every, anything I'm, I, I'm doing. So it's not my fault at all. I can't believe Detective Tap killed our partner by being so careless. Who's talking? Someone here? Oh yeah, okay, there you go. Yes! Yes! Finish the game! That <laughs> You're the reason I'm in here! <laughs> Hold on, I have to- I'm doing your little puzzle here. You got these, like, these little cabinet puzzles sometimes. I'm doing it right here. Uh, one moment, one moment. Okay, well we've been here. We saw these notes. The syringe toilet is here. But that enemy wasn't here the, uh, the first time. Yes. Nothing? All right. Oh, there we go. Detective Steven Singh. Oh no, the tombstone of our partner. 
that we murdered and a Jigsaw absolutely didn't, mur didn't murder him by setting up the shotgun trap. Is that really like a thing in the movies? Do they say, no, Jigsaw didn't kill anyone. It's not his fault. If only we handled things better. Well, I'm, I'm sorry, uh, Jigsaw. I do live... I mean, I am in, in the state of New Jersey, and here we do have uh, a, a little crime called felony murder, which does mean that if someone died in the process of you committing a felony, you are guilty of murder. I'm, I'm sorry. So, it's a kind of a... It, it's open and shut. It's open. There's no debate to be had here. My little my flashlight. There we go. Have you found your god? The drill chair. So what purpose does the drill chair have? I mean, we know, I mean, obviously, Jigsaw would find perp uh, find a use for it, but, you know, like, what is the legitimate use of the drill chair? Sympathectomy. Most of our expo experimental remote sympathectomy are going rather well. The traditional surgical sympathectomy requires the surgeon to enter the body cavity and resection several ribs to access the sympathetic nerve trunk. The thoracic nerve cluster is then dissected within the patient. This has been proven the cause to several cases of causalgia among our patients here. The remote sympathectomy, as we're calling it, uses devices similar to Moniz's acutomes are used to dissect thoracic nerve tissue rather than the brain. The size of the instruments means the patient is in less physical... Really? The massive size of this drill means the patient is in less physical danger during the procedure? But it's very hard to estimate where the nerve tissue is being dissected, leaving to some unexpected nerve damage. I don't think any damage with this thing is unexpected. Is that a sympathectomy? It looks kind of painful. <laughs> Have I found my god? I mean... I'm not really seeing the symbolism, Jigsaw. What is- what is my- what does religion have to do with the drill chair? Well, maybe I'll get it at some point. Door is sealed. It is not sealed anymore. It does have a puzzle piece on it, so I'm guessing we're getting a, a timer coming up. Oh, we got glass on the floor. Hurts our dainty little tootsies. I do not have a coupler. Pity we didn't bring, like, just a whole pocket full of couplers with us on the way. Power is a fickle thing in these old asylums. Sorry, I only have enough for me. Enough what? Oh, a bullet? Well, if enemies have guns now, that could be a problem.
kind of hard to pick the right one sometimes. Like, if I press... Like, I'm trying to get to the lower right one, and... Okay, there we go. It's kind of finicky. It can't be that. It's gonna have to be that. Have to, that wouldn't have to be that. There we go. Do I want scalpel over pipe? I don't think I've tried scalpel yet. I might as well give it a try. Mannequin usage. Using mannequins as a coupling device for prisoners has not had positive results among the more severely disturbed patients. We had hoped to use the mannequins as human surrogates to ease the patients back into societal life. The result is that patients are even more distressed and distant than before. Mannequins can still be used in the construction of therapeutic devices for scale, but the rest should be put in the storage. Hopefully someone has the use for them. I like this note. I enjoy this note. We are about to have a level full of mannequins. We need to have a story explanation for why the mannequins are here. Look, we, we bought a, like, a ton of mannequins, hoping that we could use them in, like, therapy or something. Look, we didn't put much thought into this. But uh, it didn't work. Suffice to say. I am taking some damage. Let me just... Uh, oh, yeah. Daddy likes. I can't pick up a gun. But hold on. Not impressed with our stance. Like, we're a cop. We're trained in using a gun. Could do a little better than that. Are we being gassed? Oh, uh, it's chlorine gas. Working on it. I'm not finding this pipe dial. Oh, there it is. Am I still dying while... I'm, yeah, I'm still dying while I'm doing this. Alright, well, it doesn't, it's not looking too good. Some enemies have traps off the, on their own. We'll be more motivated to attack you. Right. Have the pipe. Um, let's see. Where did it checkpoint me? Power is a fickle thing. All right, there's the guy with the gun. So let's get his gun again. Was this the was this the one with the that we just went into? It has the gas over there? What was this? Oh, okay, we have to do it then. This one's blocked from the other side. All right. So it was over here, I think. Yeah, valve. In there.
Wow, this is got to do this fast. I mean, if it's the same thing every time, I guess I can just remember like what the steps are each time as we figure them out. Nothing I like better than watching someone shoot themselves in the head and then stab myself in the neck with a hypo. And then breathe in some delicious chlorine gas. It's a Friday night. Okay, so that one has to be that. I guess the middle one would have to connect those two. to be yeah okay it was i think that was almost there explore the world around you to find weapons components and more and by more we mean chlorine gas Okay, there's the one. Man, how disappointed would Jigsaw have been if Tap died earlier? He has so much set up for him. And would have gone all to waste. Where's the box? Where was that? There it was. What does that even mean? What does it mean? Alright, watch out. Keep our balance. Whoa, 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 whoa. I think we deserve a little reward for that. Ugh. Oh, yeah. It's all our fault. If only we didn't go after Jigsaw, 
And then Singh would not have been killed by his shotgun trap. Really, it's like we shot Singh ourselves. We're so selfish to blame Jigsaw for this. Hey, we're outside. That was just a waste of a Molotov cocktail. It was nowhere near me. Neither is that one. Look, resources are limited. Hopefully that guy doesn't come after me while I'm, you know, lockpicking. He probably wouldn't. He's just gonna, maybe he's just gonna stand there and continue to throw the cocktails. Nope, not that. Nope, not that. There we go. bat. I mean, yeah, I, I guess we can open that, I suppose. We don't need a bat. I mean, we can take our time on that, but do, do we want to? Oh, it's Pigman. That's right. Forgot about Pigman. Like, Pigman has been sort of like the, I guess, the physical threat that we see on occasion, since Jigsaw himself cannot be one. We have, oh, there's a ladder over there. We see this guy with a pig mask and a red robe on occasion. Hello. Feel alive yet? What are we doing? I was about to say, were you going to throw that on yourself? Apparently the answer was yes, you were. That key. Oh, right, I have a key in me. Or at least that's what Jigsaw says. Is it true? Well, we don't know. <laughs> Neil won too. I want that key. But do we actually have to fight him? Is he just going to hang out there?
Well, I, guess, I guess if we didn't have a flashlight, you know, could get one in here. But we already do have one. We already do have one. That guy said he wants that key. Yeah, that guy? <laughs> hey, can he punch us through this? He says he wants the key, but I guess he doesn't want it that bad because he's not coming in. MK Ultra? The Technical Services Division of the Government has given us a generous grant to test the effects of a new drug. The drug is called Lysergic Acid Dalithamide, LSD. An early indication shows effect of remarkable mental pliability. More tests are needed, but so far LSD looks to be a promising hypnotic. We will begin testing on the John Doe patients immediately. The government has asked us not to refer to them by name, and can't instead please list all actions regarding this drug under the MK Ultra project. Why are we learning about this asylum, by the way? I mean, it doesn't seem like the... Like, it seems the asylum is the setting, like it's... Jigsaw has... He needed, like, a big abandoned place to put victims in. And that's why we're here. But, uh, why are we actually learning about the place? I don't really think Detective Tap cares about it. Your late partner holds the key. There's a memo. What does that say? There we go. Memo to nursing staff. Several of you have come asking what happens to the bodies of patients that tragically pass away at this facility. Many of these patients are homeless or are unable to properly communicate, so we don't know who they are. A patient like this is referred to as John Doe. John Doe's are cremated here next to medical. Families usually claim the rest, but some patients have no one to claim them and are buried in the backyard. Since this is fairly uncommon, we have had enough space for all the bodies thus far. Don't worry. We got plenty of room for all of the bodies. That was our main concern. If we had enough room to dispose of all, all the bodies. Of which there are many. One of the inmates was caught tying a wire to two ends of a hallway down by the chapel. His intent was to trip up the nursing staff, then steal whatever medication he could. Keep a lookout for these trip wires and confiscate any wire or floss your patients may have. I like the idea that even while this was an active asylum, uh, the trip wires were a thing that people were doing. Presumably they were not connected to shotguns. We can, we can. Oh, here we go. I don't know if it's really... Do we really need weapons? Like, sometimes we do.
My late partner holds the key. By the way, uh, locate the gravesite. Oh, and my thing's flashing. Yeah. Um, I'm slow because I'm walking on glass. Well, I guess he got the key. Don't forget to use your light when it's dark. Who is that? Just give me what I want! Your failure is buried ahead, detective. Oh. I have to find the key. My late partner holds it. Giles Stevens. One of us is going down. The boom. <laughs> I opened the wrong one. David? I was using my head to look at the tombstones! How am I supposed to look at these tombstones if I don't have eyes? I ask you. So inconsiderate. What was our partner's name? Sims, right? Give me the key now. You know, there's also a possibility maybe we didn't maybe we didn't like our partner, you know? Elizabeth. Cassandra. Give me the key now. Marie. All I want is out, out of this place. Jeremy. Giles. Ed. I don't want to hurt you. That was Edward. But we did not see our partner's name yet. We did not see it yet. And it seems like that the names are the same every time, so. Whoever that is, give me the key now. Right, that was where I shot was shot the first time. So I do have to I guess I do need to go around the long way. Go around, around this ways. Give me the key! I need the key. Let me take it. Put wire there. Whose is this? Jacob. There we go. That's the one. Okay, that's oh, that's the trip line. <laughs> that's the trip line I kept hitting. Can they walk through it? Now they're probably going to go around. I don't I don't think they're gonna just walk through it. They're probably not. Maybe like maybe that guy yeah, okay. Okay, there we go. That guy he did walk through it, okay. Great. Oh. <laughs> it regenerated. The tripwire regenerated. No, wait, I pick, I pressed the button to pick up the weapon. I'm wondering, did that combine with the prompt to repair the trap? Was it both at once? Okay, 
Because you do get the prompt to repair the trap when you're next to it. So it might have been that I pressed the button to repair the trap. All right, run. Yeah, there we go. Run through it. You want to die? I have to do this. One of us is going down. One of us is going down. I have to do this. There we go. All right, that's the bat. I'm also standing, like, where the trip line is. If I pick that bat up, like, it does say bat. It's not going to arm the trip line. Okay. But actually, Shovel was here. I saw a Shovel somewhere. Shovel. We haven't tried Shovel yet, I don't think. All right. Now, this. Detective Steven Singh, husband and father, murdered by partner's obsession. Maybe he deserved it. I don't know. Who's to say? You have the key to Cedar Ward. Find the angel to save her life. Are we talk oh yeah, the wife. His what? The the partner's wife? Who, bl who now blames us for the death of her husband. We saw her, like, on the TV a little bit. Okay, barricade. Open door. Open this door as well. Area contains violent patients. Also, let's see. Search Cedar Ward for Jigsaw's next clue. Is our objective. Someone wants that damn key. Seek Sanctuary. In combination lock. I don't have a fuse. I'll find one. Everyone wants that damn key. They gotta have it. Here's fuse. that we put the fuse in and do anything notice a oh, button button over here wants that damn key it's one of these guys with the, one of the box heads he wants the key he's got to have the key uh it looked like that said 838 
Well, I don't have the damn key either, it seems. But I have a key in my body. Well, neither of us is going to have the damn key. Don't forget to use the light when it's dark. Can we just try it without doing any of that? Yeah. Oh, but we don't have the damn key, is the thing. That's bolted from the other side. This needs a damn key to get to the stairs. Oh, oh, close the door. I mean, yeah, I can. Oh, will I be protected from the explosion? Maybe, like, maybe that's all it is. Maybe if the door's closed, then I won't be killed by bombs. I guess we'll find out. It is telling me to be patient. It is specifically saying be patient and close the door. So maybe that's just all it is. I guess that was the solution. Now let's find that damn key. Well, we can't leave this because there's like a thing in the way. Still bolted. That's still locked. Did it open up like a hole right here? Is there anything in the hole? Okay, it's one of the it's been a while since we've seen one of these. More syringe toilets? Sure is. That's where the key... You know, I, I, if I ask, where's the key? Why do I ask? We know it's in a toilet full of syringes.
You ended his life. Who saved yours? First, first you took his father. Will you take his mother next? Let's see. Explosion rocks downtown. Hospital employs killer doctor. Body count rises. Psychotic killer makes police fumble. Police detective. <laughs> the one on the top. Police detective. Tapped out. Detective Tap hates that one. He, he hates that headline. Body found in acid pool. It wasn't me, if that's what you mean. Like, if they just followed proper proce police procedure, nothing would have happened. It's not my fault. Let's see. Detective David Tapp, the lead officer in the Jigsaw Killer case, resigned yesterday due to unknown circumstances. The shooting death earlier this week of his partner, Detective Steven Singh, is suspected to be a factor in the detective's resignation, but Tapp could not be reached for comment. Dapp was a fine officer and defender of the law, and we will miss him, was the only comment given by the police spokesperson. Detective Mark Hoffman, a similarly decorated officer, will be taking over the lead position on the case. Okay, legal file case 011329, plaintiff Melissa Singh, spouse of deceased Stephen Singh, complaint of wrongful death, defendant David Tapp, superior officer, partner of deceased, plaintiff's complaint against defendants and alleged, first cause of death, wrongful death, negligence, plaintiff purports by the defendant's own admission, he overruled subordinate Stephen Singh's request for backup into a potential crime scene. This overruling resulted in the serious injury of the defendant and fatality of Stephen Singh. The deceased spouse, Melissa Singh, is pressing charges charges claiming severe emotional and financial damages to both herself and the dece deceased next of kin, Franklin Singh. Well, how did the court case turn out? Well, it looks like Melissa's not doing too well in the parenting department either. Let's see. Calculating killer still large. Psychopath teaches sick life lessons. Killer preaching, says Top Cop. Mysterious killer still large. Police baffled. Doctor is suspect. Asylum denizens move to a new home. Notorious killer attracts cult of devoted followers. Oh, it's Pigman. Was he not there? Are we only, are we imagining Pigman? Are we hallucinating? Are we Pigman? I mean, I don't see that wouldn't make sense, but Mhm. Mm That jigsaw made me line up the text in the mirror, and I've been doing so. I look at my own face. The true destroyer right here. That's right. It's Danny Glover. We did not get the likeness of Danny Glover for this game, sorry.
Sure, I'll add, I'll put them together to make a thing. I made a stun trap. I have hidden schematics of miniature traps in the asylum. Assemble them and they will help you survive. You use traps to save yourself. I use them to save the lives of others. Are we so different? You and I. Uh, what's that say? Wingless angels must fall. <laughs> from there? Oh. Fallen angels' wings. Celebrated police detective Stephen Singh, 34, passed away in the line of duty. He survived by his spouse, Melissa, and his son, Franklin. A memorial service is planned for visitation beginning at 1 p.m. at Sparking Oaks Funeral Home. In lieu of flowers, please make donations to the Widows of Servicemen Auxiliary. This is the end. You can't stop. This is a big circuit box. Look at the size of this thing. It's large, but I don't have a coupler. I cannot open it. Okay, more about MK Ultra. Our LSD research funding has been cut off. As you know, LSD is being used as a recreational drug and has been classified Schedule 1. This makes our research of LSD illegal. I need all documents related to MK Ultra destroyed, patient files redacted, and inventory purged. My personal view is that the, gener is that the general public is now their research sample. And if Dr. Timothy Early attempts to contact any of you, please see me immediately. I do not want him to see him in here again. Thank you. Yes. I can't believe they made LSD illegal. Now we can't use it in uh, tests. The legality of it was of our primary concern. Oh, it's quite large, isn't it? Get all of them. No, well, that one. That one leads to that. Yeah. There we go. The doors to redemption only open one by one. There's no stopping his wrath. Ah, there's no stopping his wrath. I've heard there's no stopping his wrath. Just goes around here. Just give me the key. Mm -hmm. 
All these cells have one of these. Hmm. You can break it. Is there a reason to break it? Okay, this one has the key. I feel like there's the text that's on some of the screens. Abandoned, son, or dead, alive. You know, just punctuating certain words that Jigsaw really wants you to pay attention to. Yeah? No? What? Why is that? He's got like a box. Nice try. Does he have, like, something in his hand and is, like, his hand is, like, in a cage? Not really sure what I'm seeing there. But for some reason, I don't want to kill him. I don't want us both dead. He's wired the blow. Not in the good way. I don't want to kill him. Well, he's coming. All right, let's do our thing. Okay, never mind. Please, sir. Thank you. Please leave. Okay. No, you're still in here. I dropped the switch and boom. When I die, I will explode. You want us both dead, do you? That's it? That's the explosion? He's hyping up this explosion. Thought it would be something a bit bigger. Just like a little puff. Oh, you got a coupler. I think he had way too much confidence in his explosive status. He's like, no one's gonna try to kill me. Because if they do, they'll die too because I will explode. But no, it's just kind of a... It's like he's on fire a bit.
he was very disappointed to find out that Jigsaw really exaggerated what this whole explosion business was about. There's that. Is there another door? Yeah, what's this one? Okay, we're still finding our way to the chapel. Tap, he's the one. It's his fault. All of this happened. I hate him even more. The only way to move forward is to forgive, to shed your rage, accept your suffering. I want to see him suffer. I want him to know what it's like. There will be suffering. Oh, yes. But suffering is just the beginning. Tap has everything he needs to free you. I hope you have faith that he reaches you in time. Alright, well, it looks like we're in the chapel. Hey, there she is. She's, she's right there. Okay, what puzzle do we got? Hello, Melissa. It's time to wake up and see what your life has become. You understood the risks of marrying an officer of the law. When he was killed, you let your vengeance with Detective Tap consume you. Your life crumbled and you neglected your son. I now offer you a gift, a chance to break through the numbness and taste the life you buried with your husband. Will you forgive Detective Tap, or is your hatred too great to be satiated? You're in what might be called an Iron Maiden. Move the metal cubes to the symbol and avoid the strikes. After six strikes, the device will snap shut and this place will be your doom. All right, time to puzzle it up. Magnetic puzzle. Six, they say. Getting more complicated, as you might expect. you were. I wish... I wish you hadn't saved me from that thing. I wish I were dead, too. Anything would be better than this. I can't feel You think I didn't anymore. try? You think it doesn't eat at me every day? I can't change what happened. If I could have taken his place, I would have. 
I wish I was the one in the ground, not him. Oh, David Tapp getting the last word in this time. Is she coming with us? Are you with- you? yes, you are with me. Hello. Well, I need to warn you, the last time I had a, a partner, uh, Pigman just, like, came out of nowhere and kidnapped her. I don't know what happened to her. That was kind of a while ago. Uh, but that first lady I saved, I don't know what happened to her. Now, like, the, the second one I saved, the guy, um, my old partner, he did not try to follow me, so I don't know if he got pigmanned. But if you're coming with me, there is a fair chance that you might get pigmanned, so just be prepared for that. Just be prepared for that. And David Tapp is getting better at this, it seems. Um, well, we do see a pattern emerging of... <laughs> Jigsaw saying, yeah, Detective Tap, just, like, walk around this wing of the asylum and fight some dudes and solve some puzzles, and eventually you're going to find someone who hates you, then solve a puzzle to save them. Can you do this, Detective Tap? And he's been doing it. He's been doing it. And all of them hate us. But, I mean, she's coming with us, so maybe she, maybe she can learn to forgive. And by doing so learn to live with what with her abandon ne neglecting her son i guess the objective is no objectives because we haven't actually gotten a new one yet okay our third person that we have rescued how many people do we have to rescue i don't know i don't know how many pe other people jigsaw have ki has kidnapped and is just like holding somewhere so david tap will eventually have to solve puzzles to save their lives and they will still be mad at him after he's done this but that's what we're continuing to do this i mean i wouldn't say that the plot in saw the game the movie uh has been advancing it's it's been there you know, it's bit, it's hasn't really advanced. I don't know. Maybe we'll maybe we'll encounter the other two people that we saved at some point. Maybe we'll find them. Maybe there's like maybe it's leading up to like a big final chapter where everyone gets together and we have like a big party. Uh, and we have a big party. I was about to say like like an RPG party. No, how about a literal party? We're all going to get drunk and live it up here this asylum would be a pretty good place for a party it's big it's empty no police around except david tap but he's maybe he's off duty right now and we're gonna get we're gonna get smashed here at the asylum and then th then the doll comes out the doll starts drinking i didn't even know the doll could do that it's going to be a fantastic ending. It's going to end like a the AI games end, where everyone gets together and has a big dance number, and they sing about what they learned over the course of the game. I'm imagining that's how this game will end. It'll be very good. It will, will redeem this whole thing. This whole thing. We'll be continuing on with Saw.